Hey guys, what's going on? I touch stuff here, and today I just like to go over um, the topic of the new uh, 4.1 jailbreak for iPhone 3G and iPod Touch 2Gs, um, and basically what the dev team says on their website um, for the new Red Snow jailbreak is that the jailbreak will work with the new um, with the MC models uh, of the iPod Touch third generation, and I just like to discuss that because um, it's not working for me. And uh, I just like to show you what happens, and just to avoid this jailbreak until further notice. If you have an MC model, uh, third generation iPod Touch, so I'm gonna go ahead and load up Red Snow for you guys, and I have the IPSW file right here, which I'm going to load. So browse and processing firmware, and I do have an MC model, so I'm going to click yes. Next, connecting to server and all that stuff. It's just patching right now and I'm going to install Cydia, enable battery percentage, and I do want home screen wallpaper. I don't want multitasking because it will make my iPod too slow. And I'm going to click next and um, this part right here is a little confusing. It's to put your iPod into DFU mode and so I'm going to have a window right here showing you guys um, how this is going to work. So I'm going to move this over here and click next. Have your finger ready on the home button because you're going to need to press that immediately. Next, one, two, three, power button. And it tells you instructions on what to do, how long to hold it down for. Two, one, and now I let go and I just hold the home button. And it tells you to wait 30 seconds, but you don't really have to wait 30 seconds and now it just gets stuck on waiting for a reboot so um, this is the problem here I put it into DFU mode correctly um, and it's just not uh, getting past this stage right here and on other devices you should see a white screen come up and then it will go into the jailbreaking process but um, for the MC models apparently it doesn't work and um, we have to wait until further notice from the dev team uh, to see what this issue is. So, now you might be wondering how do I get my iPod out of this because it's not booting up normally and whatnot. So, you need to do a hard reset after you cancel this. And basically, you just hold down your home button and your power button, sleep wake, whatever you like to call it, until the Apple logo pops up, which might take a little while. So, I'm going to do that right now. And basically, you just wait. Um, approximately 15-20 seconds until the Apple logo shows up. Don't worry, your iPod um, or uh, is not fixed. I'm um, not bricked, sorry. And there you go, you can release and um, it'll boot up. Not jailbroken, but uh, it's just something I like to discuss with you, my problems and whatnot with um, this new jailbreak that should work uh, and says that it should work. And uh, Apparently it doesn't, so don't do it, guys, until further notice. Other devices, you can jailbreak. It will work uh, effectively on the iPhone 3G and the iPod Touch 2G non-MC model, so that's the MB models. And um, that's all I have for this video, guys. Please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.